Yo, what's up, guys? Tom here. Today we are back with another video. Today we are going to be reacting to Need for Speed Heat, the gameplay trailer. Um, in this video, I'm going to be leaving my full opinion on it and um, tell you about the changes from the recent games like Payback in 2015, Rivals, and stuff like that. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So, um, the cops um, in this game, they look, well by the looks of it, it looks like um, it's going to be a big, bigger, big improvement to the game because in 2015 um, we didn't really have good cops um, in another stream. I weren't, I didn't put it up because I can't stream at the minute. Um, on one of Jordy, on one of Jordy's streams, um, we was I was in the Toyota Sprinter with just Nos, and he was in the Golf GTI. We was doing an escape thing. I got to um highest heat and escaped in the Toyota Sprinter with just full Nos. So their their police in twenty fifteen was just awful. Rivals in Rivals there was good uh not. They was really good in Rivals actually, but I won't. I don't really know much about the police in Rivals because I play as a cop. But from what I've saw, um, seen, um, they look good in Rivals. Um, in this game they look pretty good. They look like a bit more ruthless um, than the other games. So yeah, that's another thing. Yeah, another improvement. And um, the nighttime graphics look really good. Um, Looks like it looks brighter, more colourful than 2015, which is in some sorts good. Um, cause in 2015 it's a bit more, it's got like a blue tint to it, so it's a bit darker. Um, the graphics for the day is, I see different. It's more colourful than Payback. Um, in Payback it's just sun, like really yellow, and just it's yeah, it's not much, but this looks quite colourful. And um, yeah, it looks the graphics look really good. Limiting your progress using control moves to slow you down. Roam the open world, they have challenges and collectibles. Spend as much time here as you like. When you're ready, you switch into night mode. Build your rep by competing in illicit street races. The more you win, the more your heat will rise and the more rep you'll gain. So the more you win races, the more rep you get. And but when you win the races, your heat will go up. So when your heat's going up, the police will be more aware of you, and they they'll be wanting to catch you more. So they'll be going in a lot harder than they normally do. That sounded wrong. <laughs> Also, rhinos are in this game. Oh, Volkswagen are in this game. Yeah, so they've taken the speed cards out of um, Payback, which is really good because the speed cards in Payback, Payback was just atrocious. We were in whereas in 2015, you could actually earn your money, which where well, you could buy your parts. And, but you unlock, as you go through the game, 
So when you complete the game, you'll eventually have every more um, customer customer like uh, customizations to the cars. So yeah, that's uh, another um, big thing. So you can change the um, sound of your car, which is good, um, but some people might want the original like sound of the car. So say if you're in a Nissan Skyline um, R34, um, they want the normal sound instead of changing it. But So they can change it or keep it normal, so it's up to them on that. I was like Lena Navarro. Oh yeah, so that's new. Um, that's the first time you've been able to create your own character in um, Need for Speed games, which which I'm gonna I'm gonna be um quite quite looking forward to that. Uh, I'm gonna be looking forward to making my own character. So yeah. Yeah, you can get the app now, but on certain um, devices, I can't get it. So that is the trailer, and that concludes the trailer. My opinion on it, I think it looks amazing. Um, I think I'm going to really enjoy this game. Um, I think you can get your car impounded in this game as well. Maybe I'm not too sure. Um, yeah. So my that concludes my reaction. Um, the gra the graphics look absolutely amazing. I think they've smashed the graphics. Day and night, they made it look more colourful, made it look more realistic. The um, option in in cars. So you can get loads of more cars. Volkswagen's a new one. Um, the, there's the new Volvo. Um, I can't remember the name of it. It's got like a m big spoiler, like a really big spoiler. It's like it looks like a crane. That's what I that's what I said when I first saw it. So yeah. Um, so option in cars, get more cars in the game. So like more 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 to choose. Graphics amazing. Gameplay looks amazing. The cops. Um, yeah, they're gonna be a big part of the game. Um, they've made it more aggressive, I should say. Um, there may be a health bar. I'm not too sure. D I don't. Did I see a health bar? Right, let me check. Let me go back through. Surrender. Yeah, so there's a health bar. I'm not too happy about that because I'm a good driver. I've improved, but crash cams that's what i'm scared of uh the crash cams could fuck the game up because of the durability and you can get wrecked so yeah it's uh, it's gonna be a bit annoying but in some sorts it's a good good way of doing it as well it's a good reason to have that so yes yeah, um, it brings more realistic to the game i guess getting your car wrecked and you basically die and respawn <laughs> um yeah it's more realistic so yeah, that's a good part, but I'm a bit scared. Depend, depend if they've like done it on cars, like so. Say if a BMW, like say if um a muscle car like um a Chevrolet Camaro, that's gonna be um stronger than a normal like BMW, um because it's lighter and the muscle cars are heavier, so it's like more durable. So if they've done it like that, I'm not gonna be too happy, but we'll see, we'll see. Right guys, 
um, that concludes my reaction. I thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, please smash a like and subscribe. See you guys in a bit. Peace.